It's that time of week. It's the movie critic. They give us his film review of the week. He is Rocco Pasafume. Thank you very much, Howie. Uh, the movie that I am doing this week is Tomb Raider. It is directed by Roar Arthur and starring Alicia Vikander. It is based on the popular video games, and uh, it's actually a remake, uh, actually not a remake, but it's a, a reboot of uh, movies that were done in the early 2000s that starred uh, Angelina Jolie. This time out, Laura Croft, played by Vikander, is the daughter of a missing adventurer who finds herself on the island where her father disappeared. As I had just mentioned, that um, Angelina Jolie originally did these movies back in the early 2000s, and I, most of the time when I, I you know, I'm pretty uh, skeptical when it comes to remakes, but this time I would definitely say this is actually one remake that actually is a big improvement on the original. I, I mean, because the original Tomb Raider movies, I, they're, they're hard to take seriously because, you know, because a lot of the big characters appeal when the video games first came out was the, the, uh, the character's sex appeal, Laura Croft's sex appeal. So that's been done w away with with these new movies. These are more serious, mo it's a more serious uh, Tomb Raider movie. And uh, it's pretty good. It's, it's definitely rem reminiscent of like old style adventure movies, particularly Raiders of the Lost Ark. So um, there's much for people to enjoy. There are some drawbacks though to the movie though. It's not the most exciting um, uh, story, unfortunately. And then the other aspect, which I think will um, disappoint some people, is the fact that um, the character, the main character, um, a lot of her, um, a lot of, we don't get to see that much of, of what she does after like the first half of the film. You know, her, uh, you know, her character gets a little sidelined in the, in the second half of the movie. And, um, you know, it's, it's part of the flaw of, of movies based on video games, because video games don't have the greatest depth of characters, so it, it creates a bit of uh, some issues with this movie. But overall, I think for a, vi a movie based on a video game, this is definitely one of the better ones that we've seen. And uh, definitely a lot of it goes to the, the more serious approach, and particularly because of Alicia Vikander, she definitely brings a lot more to the Roller Croft role than Angelina Jolie ever could, and it's amazing I can even say that, because you know Angelina Jolie is a pretty uh, titanic presence as an actor, so, but um, I definitely feel that you know, even if you've never played Tomb Raider in your life, I think that there's much for people to, um, you know, to have a good time and, and, you know, get entertained by this particular movie. So I think that, for the most part, Tomb Raider is a pretty good, you know, reboot for, for once. So I give Tomb Raider three out of five stars. Thank you very much.